Hey guys, so we got an update today for year two of Cold War. It's going to be great, guys, because it's going to bring us at WMD. We're going to have the uh, Vargo 52 and there's some other stuff that they're going to be adding and updating as well. Patch notes, stuff like that. You can uh, check it out the link in the description. I'll have that for you guys. Um, it's going to be going to be great because WMD is definitely one of those uh, classic Call of Duty maps that we all loved and enjoyed back in the day. But um, the time for the update, I'll get more into that in a little bit here. But um, yeah, I just want to let you guys know, spread awareness that there is a year two update happening. So I think it's pretty great. Yeah, that's going to be great for Call of Duty in general because Cold War has definitely got those classic vibes to it. I do enjoy hopping on here. The game came out in 2020, you know, where things were kind of crazy and madness and stuff like that, you know. Just things going on with people's health and you guys know what I'm talking about. But uh, yeah, it's just... Uh, I just really am looking forward to this map coming up because it's just going to be added to the collection of classic remastered maps from Black Ops 2, and just, it's just going to be great, but yeah. So we're back, right here we got a gameplay I just played a little bit ago. We went off pretty, pretty big there, and um, yeah, I just wanted to say that it's going to be just a great time with another classic map being added to Cold War. It just makes, it's one, another reason why this game is going to be so great because they're adding another map into Call of Duty like that. Especially in the Cold War. And I'm happy that the developers are actually adding stuff to a game that's already been around for a while. Because I know in 2023, we're not going to get a Call of Duty. So basically next, the, the Call of Duty that's coming out this year, we're going to have that for two full years. So I'm just probably going to be playing Cold War, I think. A bunch of Cold War, maybe hop on Vanguard every now and then for like the, the rank play aspect. But other than that, I'll probably be playing Cold War. If I like MW2, the new game that's coming out in 2022. We'll see what happens, but uh, we're going to be going without a whole year of new Call of Duty, which is going to suck. But it is what it is, folks. You know, I'm sure that they'll come out with some great content for us while we're waiting. I mean, Treyarch will, you know, do some good for us. And I'm sure the other developers will hop in there and help figure it out, too. But, um, yeah, it's just, it'll be a great experience. I know it's going to be great. The coming future for Call of Duty is bright. You know, just got to stay positive. Keep your minds uplifted you know that's all you gotta do you know stay positive things good things will happen but yeah we I, I go off in this gameplay though we go pretty crazy but um yeah the update will be happening shortly so if it hasn't already happened you guys will be getting the update soon so that is when it's gonna happen it's happening today the update's happening today we don't know when it's gonna happen but we know what's happening today so just sit and stay tight guys and Keep watching. I'm streaming right now, so go check it out. I'll see you guys soon. Peace out.